And of course, that's a lot of effort, Erin, a lot of cooking going on. Mm -hmm. And then you've brought out some of the chefs. They're actually making some of the finer gourmet delights. For yeah, us. so in contrast to our traditional fair items, we have some gourmet items over here. This is our red wine braised beef loco moco with a fresh island calais egg cracked sunny side up on top. And um, that is our Thai chicken salad, mm -hmm. and we also have some creme brulee. And the taco rice. Now, Steve tried this already. Yep. Yes. <laughs> he was at a food eating contest. All right. Now, I have to introduce you. <laughs> Chef Ronnie Nizuti with uh, Tiki's Bar Grice. Yeah, she's calling you out. I know, Steve. Oh, I but, know. Chef, uh, how great is it to be involved? Because you're going to be doing some chef demonstrations, you know, for the grown ups and even the kids. People love to uh, get tips. What are you going to be making? Uh, we're going to do brown butter mochi uh, swordfish mm -hmm. with a smoked gouda polenta and a truffle corn sauce. There's demonstrations today at 5 and 7, and then tomorrow at 2 and 7, I believe. And every year, this event gets bigger and bigger, but it's the food chef, in your opinion, that really people stay and they like to try a bunch of different items. I think it separates us. I, I, ho I hope it separates us. <laughs> well, the grown-ups, for sure, you have plenty to choose from. I want to scan a couple of the signs because they do have the Lihing Moy Malasada they're unveiling today. Casey Waffles, Wyola Shave Ice, guys. We're going to put all the information, again, at Iolani School Fair today and tomorrow. Bring your money, bring your fun, and your smiles. There's plenty of it here. You're watching Sunrise on Hawaii News Now. All right, Chef's browning it up for me.